let me think of another scenario of would you believe, okay? Would you believe, let me think. Okay, would you believe that the government is, this is an actual conspiracy, uh, would you believe that the government has actually found a way to treat cancer and it's not, keeping yeah, keeping it because they make so much more money on treating cancer rather than fixing it. Do you think it's like now, or do you think like I just, when they why do, would they the will? The government have the cure for cancer. Like when the scientists are selling out the cure for cancer. Well, I mean, the government funds a lot of oh, scientists research. and stuff. Yeah, research. Under Trump, possibly. Maybe. <laughs> <laughs> um, but no, that would be. I'd be less likely. Like, believe it ever, or believe it now, or believe in the future? Um, to you'd be less now. likely. Okay, you'd be less likely to believe it now. Yeah. Okay. Hmm. Why do you believe it? I don't, I don't think so. I think in the future, maybe. Yeah. But. Maybe once the technology is like more yeah. advanced. Here, here's what I believe more, and I know this is just as messed up. I believe that, and I've talked to you about like bacteria advancing, I believe that they are not trying to. If they do, they're not, you know, they're not hiding it for the purpose to make more money. I mean, maybe maybe they are because they're more money, but I think they're hiding it more for the fact that they're afraid that if they don't, if they if they find a cure and start mass producing this cure, either A, it's way too rare so they can't mass produce it and they can only give it to sick people, or B, I think that like they're afraid that what comes next, like scientists have calculated what would come after cancer, yeah. and like they just don't oh, think. Like- yeah, like the next, yeah, once once cancer adapts to that antidote, yeah. they're afraid that, like, what oh, shit, yeah, body. it's gonna just, Even yeah, worse. but yeah. I could be wrong, honestly. I, yeah, I can't believe it, I can't believe it. Right. Hmm, okay. Because, yeah, I don't know, maybe I was thinking too good of people, but that would be more if we don't want something worse. Right. Or as if our solutions, we want money. Right. So it would make people sick. That's true. Okay, would you believe that, I'm trying to think, all the fast food places, all the main fast food places are being ran by the same person, are being ran by the same person, you would, (laughs) would you believe that they are all, like, hmm, let me think, um, their goal is to make us sick, yes, their goal is to make us sick, you think so, do you think, like, would you believe if, the CEO of McDonald's was approached by the government and was told to start intentionally poisoning people to kill off the population, would you believe that that would be like, if someone, if like everyone started getting sick from McDonald's and dying and someone told you that, like that's what happened, would you believe that that yeah. is the case or would you, would you believe that he just like wanted to, you know, he was like a mass murderer and been playing for years oh. or maybe it was just an accident or would you believe that, that? I think the two that I'd be more likely to believe are that it was an accident or like they accidentally put something they weren't supposed to in all the McChickens and uh-huh. so, you know, 50,000 <coughs> McChickens were, you know, right. poisoned. Right. I'd be more likely to believe that and then the second I'd be likely to believe that some, the, the government conspiracy that someone told them to poison to get rid of. Mm, okay. But I think, I, I think I'd be less likely to believe that just because it's fucking stupid. Right. <laughs> like, right. like, that's the worst way to kill a bunch of people. You think so? Yeah, because it's gonna go, it's gonna go viral. Right. For sure. Like, all these people, would they have a common, they ate McDonald's. Right. So, why, you know what I mean? Like, it's too, you can connect the dots too easily with that. Yeah. Okay. All right, here's one. Would you believe, would you believe, uh, okay, so I, I was watching a documentary. I think it might have been even Super Size Me. And, and basically, the... McDonald's has more employees than active military, than the United States has active military. I think it's 1.6 million McDonald's employees in the world and 1.3 million um, active military. Would you believe that McDonald's is secretly training people and or would you believe McDonald's would eventually try and take over the world slash United States slash any country? I don't think so. You don't think they would? I don't think they have enough range or like um, of... of, uh authority, I guess. Like, I don't know. <laughs> you don't think so? No. Jesus. What the hell? Such lame bombers. 
if you own McDonald's, would you try? To take over the world? To take over like a country, even if it's like a small country in Africa. I just, they're a food chain, you know what I mean? Like, yeah. Oh, you which, mean like all of those people? Yeah, like you would like give them f like spears and be like, all right, we're taking this country to our own. And then we'll be like, if you want to eat, like you have to, I mean, they might not even be able to use force. They'd just be like, if you want to eat, because we got the this. beef, you got to, you got to comply to our laws. Would you try and do it if I, you own McDonald's? I wouldn't try. You wouldn't try and do it? Oh, I'd definitely try and do you it. you try to do it? Try you know, I got McDonald's. <laughs> Once you get McDonald's, like, what else is there? Right. <laughs> Google. Google. Do you think Google, Google would? Google would definitely take over the world, yeah. You think, okay, think Amazon it, or Google? Or Apple? Amazon, Google, or Apple? Google. Or Microsoft? Google. You really think Google? I think Google I think would Amazon. be the ones to take over the world, but I don't think it would be like an uprising and like all of my employees here you have a spear. I think yeah. it'd be like a technological uprising. Do you think they'll like hack like the mm -hmm. US government yeah. and like <laughs> spill all the secrets? Uh, yes. Yeah.